Okay guys it's me Imad from Nelson Darwin Park Tech YouTube channel so today in this video tutorial we will learn about how to create an excel file within vb.net the compiler which we are using is the is the Java, is the visual studio.net so you can see that we have opened our Microsoft Visual Studio now we need to click on file go to new and click on project here we can see a lot of options you need to click on visual basic windows and windows forms application change the name of the file and click ok now we got our programming window and this is in the form of GUI now we will drag one push button okay now we will double click that push button and it will lead us to the callback of that particular push button okay here first you must know that that we have to import certain classes or certain uh, class so that we can fetch certain functions but before going towards that we need to go to project okay we, we, we need to click on add reference we, we we have to go to type libraries and here we will uh, search for ms office excel microsoft office uh, where it is we we have to go for that microsoft and here it is excel okay so we need to tick it out okay microsoft excel 14.0 and click ok okay now after this has been done we need to write or on the top of the public class we need to write imports excel is equal to microsoft dot office dot interop dot excel okay so this is just like that we have imported our library okay you do not need to be uh, you do not need to go in the complexities of all these classes which belongs to certain major classes so you just have uh, have kept in your mind that this is just like the library edition in our program now what we need to do is to come to the callback of that particular push button and here we will uh, write dim applic excel okay now this is applic excel is just a variable or object okay nothing special okay is excel dot application excel dot dot application now what is this thing now now we have rather than writing excel dot application we will just write applic excel and it will it will just means this thing that is excel dot application okay so just like short format okay so it is a variable and it denotes all this now we need to write because uh, after this thing we need to write certain workbook workbook as excel workbook is excel file always consists of certain workbooks so so we need to write uh, wrkbk is excel dot workbook so so rather than to write all this we will just write wrkbk in in, in 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 here down okay so so it will work fine we also know that there are sheets so we will write dim dim sheet is excel dot worksheet worksheet okay now simple sheet variable will work as excel dot worksheet okay now we need to write applic excel 
dot visible sorry applic excel is equal to create object now this is this is our measure function that is create object what sort of object excel dot application okay so we will write excel dot application okay so create object it will create an object for us which is of excel okay means that it is it is going to create an excel application for us okay so now we will write we will set its properties to true dot visible dot visible is equal to true what is mean by it we are just set setting its visibility to true and nothing else okay applic excel this is a variable which is denoting which, which is just denoting this excel dot application is equal to true means that okay remove the semicolon now we will now we will try to add our workbooks inside we are attaching our workbooks to a main excel application so we will write workbook is equal to applic excel okay dot workbooks dot add dot dot workbooks books dot add okay now this will add our workbook with the main application and then assign all the things to this variable is equal to here is the assignment operator means that workbooks will be attached to the excel application and then it will be given to wrk bk okay now we will come towards our sheet sheet is equal to now we will attach these workbooks these sheets to workbook and then we will assign all of them to a single variable that is sheet so workbook dot active sheet active sheet so this is sheet workbook dot active sheet and here obviously there must be if there are sheet there must be cells so and uh, in excel there are cells okay one comma one means uh, first row first column one comma one dot value dot value is equal to first that was whatsoever you want to write in the first cell in first sheet in first cell okay you can write first or second or anything okay and then we will write applicax dot quit and it will quit but before quitting it will obvi obviously offer us something like uh, that uh, whatsoever either we want to save it or not so we will okay now you can see that uh it has offered us a save option so we will write save and uh, on desktop and book 13 okay and here in this way we have created our book 13 okay so hopefully you got the concept so thanks for visiting our channel and don't forget to subscribe